Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So tonight, I actually have a little bit of a sweet tooth and I decided, you know what? I'm gonna take Evelyn out for a little dessert treat. So I was looking online and I wanted to find a really cool spot that's somewhere we've never been, somewhere that's a little bit different. And in fact, I found a place that's not too far from here. The place looks really good and they have some amazing looking desserts. Now, the place is called Inside Scoop and I'm gonna leave the details of the location right here down below in the description. Don't forget to check it out later, but anyway, we were looking online and they had these amazing looking desserts with ice cream and you know different toppings but what blew me away was that it had waffles. Now for me and as an American, and I guess maybe even for Evelyn as a Panamanian, a waffle is more considered something that you would eat for breakfast, right? You know, you have your Eggos, you have your maple syrup, you have your butter, you have all your good stuff. But over here in Malaysia, I've noticed lately that a lot of desserts come with waffles. Now, maybe somebody that's a local that's been here for a long time or somebody that grew up here, maybe they can explain a little bit about why waffles is such an important dessert style food here. Actually, in fact, I've seen it in more than just desserts. I've seen it with pizzas. I've seen it with hamburgers. I don't know. I've seen it with lots of different things. But today, we're obviously going to go check it out in a dessert fashion. Now, if anybody that truly knows me, they know I'm a bit of an ice cream fanatic. A long time ago, when I was younger, in my teenage years, I used to hang out with my buddies and I would break out a gallon of ice cream and just go to town with a spoon and everything just sitting there. And I'm not lying, probably like 10 minutes into just hanging out with my buddy, that gallon of ice cream would be down to probably at least half. And yeah, I'm not very proud of myself for these kind of moments, but maybe you guys can relate. If anybody else is like me with their ice cream and they just can't put it down sometimes, let me know down in the comments below. So as I was looking online about this place, about Inside Scoop, I saw they had this really famous, or at least one of their signature dishes, which is a, like a black waffle, and it came with some sort of like caramel icing on it or something. Of course, to just add the calorie explosion on top of that, they put on one of my favorite types of ice cream, peanut butter ice cream. Oh man, I'm super excited to go check this place out. The only thing that stinks is tomorrow, Evelyn has a really big English exam. She's been studying English at one of the English institutions here in downtown Kuala Lumpur, and she's been doing phenomenal. I'm very proud of her. I'm super excited that she's been just growing as a learner. And of course, as a teacher, you know, we're super excited to see those kind of things happen. Any minute. ¿Qué tipo de helado va a comer? No sé para dónde vamos. Yo te mostré la foto. No, porque tú dijiste que tú habías elegido el lugar, no sé. No sí. sé qué, qué lugar es, solo sé que venden helados. I did tell her. place called Inside Scoop. We're super excited to try out some of the different flavors that they have. Well, me, I'm definitely gonna try that peanut butter, whatever concoction that I saw online. Evelyn, what are you gonna try? Voy a ver. <laughs> so she's still undecided. So we're gonna go inside and we're gonna go check it out.
¿Qué tipo de helado pediste? Me pedí un helado de guayaba. ¿Y qué es guayaba? Una fruta, una fruta dulce, bien rica, que yo comía mucho en mi casa. Check out these waffles. Oh my God. I'm in heaven right now. These things look so good. So I ended up getting a peanut butter and jelly waffle with some sort of ice cream. I, I forgot, oh, hazelnut. I got hazelnut ice cream. And then Evelyn got that signature one that I was talking about. She got the salted egg yolk something or other. I don't know, it looks good. What do you think? ¿Qué tal? Is it good? How would you describe it? peanut butter, you would love this one. Oh, man. I'm not gonna lie, this is probably the best waffle I've ever had in my life. Really? Yeah, this is definitely gotta be the best waffle I've ever had in my life. So I got a hazelnut ice cream on it to try and complement the peanut butter. It's a lot of nut flavors, but man, it's good. Dr. Evelyn's in the house. Dr. Dustin está en la casa. So we just got done eating here at the ice cream place. Oh man, this food was amazing. So I definitely recommend, fellas, if you guys got a girl out there, take them out here because I tell you what, they will absolutely love you for it and I bet you will enjoy yourself. So check it out. shopping plazas. Actually, I came here one night with a few of my co-workers for a wine night. They had this really good happy hour at this place called La Cave? La Cave? <laughs> Something like that. Yeah, I don't remember the name very well, but all I know is it's in this area somewhere. And yeah, there's a lot of really cool things to see out here. A lot of good places to go and shop and actually go out and eat at. So, highly recommend this area. So we're gonna start heading back to the house. Evelyn's gotta study for her test, otherwise she's gonna flunk out of it and I don't wanna be the fault for that. So we'll see you guys back at the house. All right guys, we are back here at the house. That place was amazing. We had so much fun going out there and checking out all the different locations. But more importantly, the ice cream was delicious. You guys have to go out there, try this place out at least one time, especially if you're an ice cream addict like me. But anyway guys, we're gonna wrap up the video here. Hopefully you guys had fun coming out with us and next time we're gonna try out another place. Also, if you guys wanna leave a comment about maybe your favorite ice cream place here in Kuala Lumpur that Evelyn and I can go check out, I really appreciate that as well. So, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you guys next time.